be a bit more polite because we're not all horrible Take human the camera off my face and I'll be polite. Okay? I don't want you around here. That's right. not up to you, mate. No, come, come, come in this property, it's up to me, pal. So welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're here in Derbyshire <laughs> looking at Muller. And we've seen these before, haven't we? These make like yogurts, desserts. Can't hear you, mate. What's it say here? Please use the path to pedestrian gate and report to gatehouse. So it wants you to use this pedestrian footpath here and report to the gatehouse. But the path doesn't go to the gatehouse, does it? Excuse me, where's the gatehouse? It, on the sign it says report to the gatehouse, look. Yeah, well, it says, says no parking in front of this gatehouse. Oh, oh of course. This is it the gatehouse. big letters on the top. Ah, so, okay, okay. okay. My friend. <laughs> I don't, what's, is he trying to close that as I'm opening it? Yeah. That's rude. It says report to the gatehouse. Yeah, it's a man with a camera, mate. What, don't they like being filmed? Well, I don't know. You think you've got a great big machete or something. All right. I just wanted to tell him that we're going to take the drone up, that's all. Just be polite. It's not, it's not allowing us to communicate. No, it's not. What can I say? I want to know if they're lactose intolerant, though, can we? Yeah, well, what should we do now? Because we've been denied denied the um, opportunity to communicate about we our I suspect he might be on the phone to uh, some senior management somewhere for them to come around. Right. I'll just see if this is open here. <laughs> no? <laughs> uh. All right, well, um, yeah, I don't know. With this one, they're not... Uh, they're not cooperating, so yeah, I'm just going to get the drone up. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that in my life. It's bizarre, can, isn't it? I can see the heads moving around inside. It's like, you know, the ship sinking, abandoned ship, but you can't abandon ship because there's somebody out there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. So we've seen many um, reactions to people walking up with a camera, haven't we, in our time. Mm. But for them just to completely lock down and not communicate at all, yeah, very mean, unusual. It's not even open the window to tell us to piss off, has it? No, it's not asking us to leave. And I've tried to um, open the window to resume. Oh, well, look, now what they're doing, are they putting boards or something up at the window? No, I thought they were putting boards or something up at the window as well. Right, well, I'm just going to return back to the public land and get the drone up. Yeah. Because uh, obviously security here just uh, seem very unusual. So most of the car park is empty, look. And they've only got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, just ten cars in the whole car park. So I would not expect this place to be operational with such little staff. And even here, obviously, those two are the security uh, vehicles. So, yeah, let's get the drone up. See if we can see any sign of life here. I don't think we are going to with the, uh, the lack of um, cars in the car park. But we shall see. Oh, what we got here? A dog unit? Dog unit. <laughs> yeah, what's this all, what's this all about? Yeah, is it operational? No. I thought not. Part part. Sorry? Part and part. Because there's ten, 10 cars in the car park there. No managers there. So there's no production going on? 
Why not? Just what the owner decided. Are they still manufacturing this product elsewhere? Different sites, I assume so, yeah. Can I, can I, I, still, I still get my yogurts. Can I, yeah. can I ask a serious question? Yes, of course you can. You know in that security office there, yeah. have you got children working in there? No, why? Seriously, you've not got children working in there. <laughs> because somebody stuck their head out of the window, shouted something. My mate DJ is trying to, like, converse with them, like trying to open the window a little bit to just... Yeah talk to them and every time they open the window about that much they slam in the window shut uh, and they did that what must have been half a dozen times wouldn't it yeah just being a little bit rude, do, do you know what i would suggest right just say guys the site's closed there's nothing to see please leave yeah, 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 yeah. but they didn't even ask us to leave no. so we're just we're traveling the area and anything that's interesting i mean muller is a global brand yeah, yeah. so we're just going to take our drone up normally we see some action so, but there's nothing to see here. <laughs> well, there is. Maybe but a few keep the win- plane, There plane is, but they keep the windows shut. So, they've got on the phone to you to say, get down here quick with a dog. They've just said people are around with cameras, so I've, I've dealt with another guy before who used to work here. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. What, a YouTuber? Yeah, yeah. What's he called? Uh, old chap glasses. Um, yeah, he had his tripod in it, almost fell over. You know who we are, don't you? I don't know. I do you recognise know. your hair, to be fair. You recognise my hair? Yeah, I don't know. Right. You know at night when you go to bed? Yeah. What do you put on? <laughs> well, like the same light, but what would you normally Just put on? Just step outside the gate for a quick break. What would you normally put on? Nothing. That, that's me personally. All right, all right, all right. I'm PJ. And he's... Do you want to come in, mate? Yeah. I'll, I'll speak to you. Sorry, I think he was, yeah. yeah. My friend, you just need to change your approach. Be a bit more polite, because we're not all horrible Take human... Take the camera be- off my face and I'll be polite. OK? I don't want you around here. Well, right. It's not up to you, mate. No, come... You come in this property, it's up to me, pal. Well, my friend... up to you whether we're here or not. You've got signs that say all visitors report to the gatehouse, so we just wanted to have a friendly conversation, that's all. I've got some nappies in car. You really have let the side down today. If you come back, you could make it better. You know, it, it's this sort of behaviour that shouldn't really be happening to photographers. See, I, I, I said to the last chap, I go, I'm, I'm quite interested in photography. Yeah, well, anyway, I'm PJ and he's DJ, and we're related because my second name's Audits and his second name's Audits. <laughs> I, I think I saw one of your videos on TikTok, maybe uh, the past couple of days. Yeah, he's, he's, uh, he's my dad. I do, I do remember, I do, now you said DJ, it does ring, it does ring about my ears. Over the... Look at dog then, come on, get dog out, let's have a look at it. What do you what? think, what do you think now? Hey? What do you think now? What, is it a German Shepherd? What is it? Yes. Hey? It does sound yes. like a German Shepherd, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? Does it sound like a German Shepherd? Does it? <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I won't get him out because obviously it's mine. in German, can't you hear it? <laughs> Actung! <laughs> and d- just so we know, um, sort of routine daily, do, what sort of exercise do they get? They get out every hour. Every hour, brilliant. That's me personally. Others, maybe not so much. Others, maybe more. But obviously, we do, I do daily training with them, you know, basic healing and stuff. So, why don't you want to get a dog out? It's just, it just looks like a bad image. It no, be, no. It can, it, it can be easily twisted. No, not be seriously. Not, seriously. I'm not, I'm not saying you would. No, but it's just that, I, well, you know, I've got dogs and I've got German Shepherds. Obviously, without vocal contact, people... And they can't... ...visually see it as a, You know, it can't get us. So. Yeah, and the footage could be edited to make them look bad. Yeah. But do you treat it as a pet or a working dog? Or both? Both. That's me personally. Do you take it home? Yeah, I'm sat I'm sat for Oh, right. So it's your own dog? Wow. So even the company's yours? I'm um, subcontractor. So do them guys work for you or are they separate? What guys? The, well, the gentleman that's just come here. No, so they're security for here. And what are you then? I'm also security for here, but for a subcontractor. Got ya. So do you do the, just this plan card? I work all over the country. Alright, okay. I actually did um, a little contract anymore, so I can't say. Yeah. Uh, uh, are you a local lad? lad? I am, yeah. Clayton. Ah, AX Squad? No, I was at A and did a year in the TA. Yeah, I only did a year in the TA. Yeah, it's still a year, mate. 
What were you in? 58 signal squadron. Signals. Daddy, daddy, did it, did it. Got closed down. Oh, did it? Yeah, made it into recruitment office. Oh. So, yeah, I left and I started doing this. <laughs> so, do you know how that that van is like a long wheelbase? Yep. What sort of space has the dog got in the back? So the dog's got from um, where the middle light is all the way back, and then the full width. The full width, and from that reflector, and the middle reflector all the way back. It's just got a fair bit. And it's got fresh air with the air vent open. Yeah, it's got air, air, air vent front. They've got a slided door front underneath my bed. Wow. So they've got through and through uh, ventilation. Um, they've got their own fan on the rear door that takes out So air. you've got your own be bed in there, have you? Yeah, shell, gaming computer. Amazing. That's all some YouTube videos on. <laughs> yeah. And I can oh, see. Look. Go on. Oh, oh, open up then. Come on, let's have a look. Yeah. Wow, if we get to see inside this, that is amazing. Yeah, but if it's travelling country, it's got to have a certain amount of comfort with it. Yeah. Oh, wow. We've, ju we've just been next door in the modular buildings, and it's very similar. <laughs> Who's done that? Have you done that? I've done most of it. Not, not all the woodwork, but I've done some pressure. Have you got a little boys' room in there? For emergencies, yeah. For, just for emergencies? Just for emergencies. Yeah, because... Uh, where do the big boys go, then? Not mine. He said, it's a, <laughs> he, he said it's a little boy. It's a little boy's room. You didn't say no. I, I mean, personally, I would have said no. It's not a little boy's room. It's a big boy's room. So it's only a small toilet. Yeah. All right. Like I said, pretty much. It, it was referring to you rather than the toilet. You know what I mean? Things like that. Once you've done a number two in them, and you've really got to change the chemicals and stuff and empty yeah, it. Yeah. Where really, if there's somewhere else that you can do it, you would choose that as a first. I don't actually use chemicals though. All right. What do you use? Please. All oh, right, okay. As long as you use it within 20 for 24 hours. Yeah. It's still... Perfect. I mean, that's why they made McDonald's, weren't it? Well, that's what I thought when they were a lorry driver. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's my... That's the donkey near barking. Oh, wow. What yeah. is it? Is it a roadie? She's a Belgian Malinois. A what? Belgian Malinois. Belgian Malinois. And then her daughter is a Belgian Malinois cross Dutch herder. Wow. Um, I used to have a roadie bitch back. They're nice. I do like Rohesians. Oh, yeah. Oh, Amanda's a bag of salts. How you doing, mate? Come and talk to us. They seem to have calmed down now. It's all about the approach. You've got to treat people how you expect to be treated back. I know the law. You guys know the law. Did you want to say your first name? Just, just, uh, I'll let you guys put my name. <laughs> no, uh, no, my name's Mike. Uh, 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 Mike. Is, Thank you, Mike. If you work for yourself, you know, you're obviously very professional in what you do. He is, yeah. You travel all over the country. Uh, are you at work full time? I work you... pretty much every day. Right, okay. I was just thinking that I everybody. I was just thinking that everybody could see how professional you are and everything. Oh yeah, people are going to love Mike. And they, and they might get in touch with you to um, do a bit of work for them. <laughs> but if you've got enough work, then you, you're not bothered, are you? More work the merrier, mate. More work the merrier. Same, same for you guys. More sights you can see. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. So yeah. if somebody did want a dog handler then, Mike, yeah. how would they contact you? Uh, usually they could either go through my, my bus or they go through the company. Oh, so you are ICTS then? So we work on behalf of ICTS. Okay. So there you go, guys. If you did want Mike's uh, professional services, and that's the way to do it. So obviously inside here. professional services. Yeah. Facebook as well, obviously. Everyone's on Facebook nowadays. Well, as ICTS or...? I assume they are, yeah. Okay. So yeah, there you go. Obviously inside this building, there's valuable assets that they want to protect. They've employed you for some I reason. Can't comment on that no, because no, I, I obviously. No, of course, of course. Um, is it worth us taking the drone up? Are we going to see anything interesting? I wouldn't have thought so. You'll probably see me sitting having a cup of tea with the dog. <laughs> 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 right, well, listen, well, well, my, I, I just made a brew. I made a nice little coffee. It's not going cold, is it? No, I had to spill it. Uh, oh, sorry, mate. Really are. Now you have made me feel bad. <laughs> made you feel bad? I've got plenty of coffee. I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm a, I'm a squaddy. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Mike, from myself, thank you so much for your uh, professional behaviour. No, you're right, I'm going to step away now just to do my outro. It's been a pleasure meeting you. Yeah, yeah same here. You've been an absolute So, yeah. What a turnaround, eh? From Muller. Here in Foston it is, a DE postcode. When we first approached, 
the guys over there just completely shut down. Yeah, you know, if that's how they want to behave. But it doesn't really give a good impression, does it, of the company that they're uh, working for. And then Mike comes along, you know, more senior, more experienced. And redeems the situation. So thank you very much for watching that video. And uh, bearing with us <laughs> from Muller. If you have enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up for me. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.